Hello and welcome to another Drum Synthesis 101 with F Expansion Tremor. In this episode we're going to be synthesizing a snare drum, specifically a very vintage sounding drum machine snare, something similar to the Ace Tone Rhythm Ace. If you're following along with F Expansion's Tremor, you can download the preset that I'm working on here from the link in the YouTube description. You don't have to be using Tremor, however, you can follow along using just about any synth or drum machine that has a couple of envelopes, an oscillator, and a noise source. Let's take a listen to the preset I'm working on. So we've got a nice vintage vibe there. I should probably say that I've got a couple of master effects on here just to kind of add to that vintage sound. I've got a distortion and an EQ. I'm going to leave those on just because they help give that kind of full mid to low bottom end that you associate with the vintage sound. So let's have a listen to the snare drum in question. It's quite a simple snare drum but it's nice because it's got a full body and it's got a nice noise element so it cuts through the mix quite nicely. So I'm going to reset this channel and we'll start synthesizing this from scratch. That's our default sound in Tremor. I'm going to start by removing the oscillator from the signal and increasing the noise. And then what we'll do is we'll just get the amp envelope sounding right. So I've adjusted the decay and curve there of the amplitude envelope just to get the right kind of shape to the sound. And now let's get the noise source sounding right. Tremor actually has a lot of options for shaping the noise. So that's given us the kind of top sizzly end to the snare, but now we need to add in the body. For this we're going to use the oscillator. I've changed the shape of the oscillator to a triangle waveform and I've tuned it down a bit to roughly a kind of D, D sharp. Now the sound needs a little bit more attack to it. What I've done here is I've taken the fast envelope, which is this envelope here, and that's actually a faster envelope than the amplitude envelope, so it's just giving me a spike at the beginning of the sound, and I've used that to increase the volume of the oscillator. So the oscillator's louder just in the initial transient of the entire sound. I've added in some sub oscillator there to give me even more bottom end and I'll just tweak the filter and, and see if we can shape the sound some more. That's sounding quite nice, let's have a listen to it in context.
At this point we might want to uh, put a little compression on the snare. A reasonably fast attack and reasonably fast release. And we'll push the input up a bit. And there we've got a pretty good sounding classic drum machine snare. Join me soon for more Drum Synthesis 101.